Hey guys, in this problem, we're told about a layer of water touching a diver's skin, and we're asked to estimate how much energy is used by their body to heat it up to skin temperature. The first thing we need to figure out is how much mass of that water that we're looking at is. We can't figure out how much energy is used to heat it up without knowing the mass of the water. And we can figure out the mass from the density and the volume of that water. Because recall that the density is equal to mass divided by volume. So if we rewrite this to solve for mass, and that'll give us the mass from the density and volume. So of course, the volume of this layer of water is going to be equal to the product of its surface area and its thickness, both of which are given to us in the problem. So if we're trying to find the mass of the water, this is equal to the density of the water, multiplied by the surface area of the water, multiplied by its thickness. All right. So the density of seawater is about 1,025 kilograms per cubic meter. We're multiplying this by the surface area of the water, which the problem tells us to estimate is one squared meter. Then we're multiplying it by the thickness of the water, which the problem tells us is, is 0.5 millimeters thick. So we got to convert that into meters. So that's 0.5 millimeters, or 0.5 multiplied by 10 to the power of negative 3 meters. And if we put all this into a calculator, we find a mass of about 0 0.5125 kilograms. So now that we have the mass, we need to figure out how much energy is used to heat it up. And so a helpful thing to know for problems like this is the energy unit of one kilocalorie. And a kilocalorie is helpful to us because one kilocalorie is equal to the amount of heat needed to raise one kilogram of water by one degree Celsius. So a conversion factor we can construct from this, that one kilocalorie is the equivalent or one kilogram of water and one degree Celsius. So we can use this term as a unit conversion to figure out how much heat is needed to increase this much mass. So for us, we know the mass, is, we now know the mass, it's 0.5125 kilograms multiplied by, and for the temperature, we're told that the water enters the suit at 10 degrees Celsius and is warmed to the diver's skin temperature of 35 degrees Celsius. So that means that the temperature change is 25 degrees Celsius. 35 minus 10 is 25. So 25 degrees Celsius, when you multiply it by the conversion factor we set up to convert into the amount of energy needed to heat it up by one degree, one degree Celsius, and if we put this into a calculator, we find an energy of 12.8 kilocalories. So this is the amount of energy required to heat the water up this much. But the problem asks us not to answer in kilocalories, but instead to answer in this weird unit of candy bars, which the problem tells us is equal to 300 kilocalories. So one candy bar is equal to 300 kilocalories. So if we put that into a calculator, we find that this is equal to about 0 0.043 candy bars, or as the book rounds it, to two significant or to one significant figure of 0 0.04 bars. And so that is the answer to this problem. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing, as that'll help me out in making more videos like this. And if you have a request for a future video, leave a comment down below, and I'll try to help you out. But that's all for now, and I hope you all have a lovely night. Bye-bye.